All right, so we have a slide track mounted down on our base plate. We've got two supports for a drive shaft. Now, ideally, your kit would have two of these gray supports, but my kit didn't because the other kit has it. So you might have to, you know, trade with those other people. And then this other gray piece, some worm gears. Now, again, there's a certain size worm gear that fits this. And then our slide car. All right, so you got to put the track. You got to put the track down first. You have to attach the gray to the car. You have to get some frames up, some supports, some supports for our drive shaft. Get the worm gear. Get the drive shaft through. Get some worm gear put on it. Get some collars to keep the worm gear in place. Get some collars to keep the shaft in place. And here's what happens. It allows us to take a rotational motion and make it linear. So imagine putting something on top of this, attaching something to this, a seat, a belt, a, a car, a package, whatever. And by turning it, we can get it to move it in a linear motion. And if you go too far, it comes off the track. I went too far. And popped off the track so maybe you want to borrow the borrow some worm gear from the other group that way you have more than just two um the other thing about worm gear is they've got little notches in them and they should have a nub on it. See that nub right there? That nub should fit into a notch so that the spiral is continuous.